Hello students, hello parents, faculty, staff. I miss you all already. It's been a while since making any videos um, since the last time we were doing virtual school and I realized that I never put any videos of the completed tall bike. I did some videos of me making the tall bike, but if you're interested, this is what the completed tall bike looks like. Coming to you today to give you some tips for dressing for the colder weather. I enjoy being outside. I like taking the students outside for phys ed. It's nice to be able to take our masks off. I also think it just does a lot for you mentally to be outside personally anyway. If I spend the day inside without any time inside, it just makes me feel kind of off. So I think it's important to get outside and I think it's important to be comfortable when you are outside. I've spent a lot of time outside. I told some of the students um, two stories so that they might believe me when I tell them this tip. Oh, by the way, bottom line is wear two pairs of pants when it's cold outside. So if you don't want to watch any more of the video, um, wear two pairs of pants, just try it out today and see how you like it. And that's just something for me for everyday life. If it's colder outside, I'm normally wearing two pairs of pants. Um, but I told them two stories about the hottest temperature that I've ever been in. That was when I was doing a bicycle tour from Seattle, Washington, and we finished in Las Vegas, Nevada. So we rode down the coast all the way till we got to San Francisco. And then we cut in and as we went over to Las Vegas, we rode through Death Valley. And as you're descending down and down and down into Death Valley, I think the temperatures were like 115 when we were there. And the further down you go into the valley, the hotter it gets. And I remember cruising down this downhill. You have the wind blowing on you, which is normally cooling you off. But then every once in a while, these gusts of wind would rush up out of the valley and hit you. And it was like opening an oven door and the wind would actually make you more hot this hot wind and it was it was pretty scary but uh we we rested there at a, at a spot where there was water and then we wound up riding through the valley at night so that it wasn't as hot and when we finished the next day um, we'd done over a century a century is when you ride 100 miles in a day so we'd done over 100 miles that day with with our loaded touring bikes it was uh, a cool experience to look back on um I'm not sure if I'd want to do it again. Uh, and then the coldest place I've ever been was summoning Mount Washington in New Hampshire in the winter time. And when I did that, it was negative 30 and 50 mile per hour winds that day. Again, another thing that I, I know I, I definitely would not do that again. That wasn't uh, smart looking back on it, not worth the risk. Um, but anyway, through those experiences and through um, ice climbing has been another thing that's taught me a lot about dressing for the outdoors because when you're ice climbing, you're climbing, so you're putting out a lot of effort, you're building up heat in your body, and then when you're, you've stopped, then you reach a belay, you, you set an anchor, you're stopped, you're belaying your partner then for a while, so you're just hanging out on the side of a frozen waterfall trying to stay warm while, while you're not moving. So it's really challenging to, to dress for that. And the uh, two pairs of pants is something that um, comes from that as well. Because one of the benefits that I find of wearing two pairs of pants is, or even three pairs of pants, um, it, it often doesn't make you too hot. So when you are exerting yourself, if you're wearing too many jackets and you start to get hot, it's an awful feeling to be hot when it's cold outside. Because that's really what you want to avoid when it's cold outside is getting too hot and then sweating because once you're wet with sweat it makes it really hard to get warm again some people think of wearing layers to stay warm i like to think of laying where wearing layers to actually stay just the tiniest bit cool like it's a like it's a hot day and you've walked into some refreshing air conditioning you know that you can step back out into the heat you know that you could put on your your heavy jacket again and be warm again you want to be just the tiniest bit cool so that you're not sweating. So you're not wearing layers to be warm. You're wearing layers to stay just the tiniest bit cool so that when you stop moving, you can put them on and stay warm. And personally with, with my own kids and with students in, in phys ed class, I like to give them the option of taking their jacket off. I know a lot of times parents always want their kids to wear their coat, but I think that a lot of times people underestimate how much heat your body generates when you are exercise and when you're moving around so i always like to give people the option to take it off and then they're going to bring warmer clothes because they know they have the option to not be hot and sweaty when it's cold outside which is very unpleasant um 
Okay, so wearing layers, wearing, wearing two pairs of pants. So for me, the typical setup um, when I'm at school for the day is I'm wearing some track pants underneath of my regular pants, which are just kind of like the school uniform pants. And then sometimes also put rain pants over top of those pants. Um, so if it's a day that I know that it's gonna be 50 degrees or less, I'm normally wearing two pairs of pants like I am right now. Um, if it's a day that, I, that it surprises me, I don't know that it's gonna be colder outside or the wind is making it really cold or it's overcast that's making it cold and I'm only wearing one pair of pants, then I'll put my rain pants on over top of my work pants. And if it's a day when it's, when it's really cold and I already know that it's gonna be cold and I'm wearing some track pants and then another pair of pants, um, I'll put on my rain pants over top of that. So wearing three pairs of pants. Um, is there anything else? Hey Batman, you wanna come? You wanna come be in our be in our video here? Can can you come over here? I found this. Oh great! You found the bullet. Good job. Thank you. Uh, we got Batman here. He is. Are you warm? Um yeah. If you get cold, will you tell me? Um yeah. Okay. Thank you. I'm doing a video for school. Oh, why for school? Uh, I'm telling about how to dress for when it's cold outside. 